Weren't you on the British diving team? I was on the British team for uh, almost 10 years. It was a silly thing. I'd, I got into it really late. Uh, to be, you know, efficient in uh, any kind of international sport, you have to start when you're like four or five years old. You're looking pretty efficient there. <laughs> Can I just say? Yeah. <laughs> that was way back in the day. Yeah. <laughs> Ouch. That one hurt, the one on the end. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, had you been diving all... I'm still all... recovering from that picture. <laughs> have you been diving all your life, or how did this happen? No, I was, uh, I was on holiday in Florida with my mum and dad uh, in Miami, believe it or not. And uh, there was a guy who used to do a high dive at noon every day from one of the hotels that we stayed in. And I went, you know what, I'm, when, we, when we get home, I'm going to do that. <laughs> and literally, I joined the club. I was like, you know, 11, 12. Uh, and uh, wow. within a year, I was on the British team. And then it just took a, its own momentum. And uh, I just spent the next 10 years doing that. Did uh, you ever want to compete in the Olympics? Yeah, I did like three Olympic trials, and I never went to the Olympics. Uh, but I, I did tons of internationals all around the world, and uh, it was good. But, uh, you know, I was, I was doing that and then selling the jewellery, and it was like... <laughs> I didn't know what I wanted to do, and then, So, you know, guy, guy Richie comes up to you with the jewellery, you say, I'm going to dive like that. Things come pretty easily for you, yeah. don't they, Jason? I just got to find something I really want to do. <laughs> did you know this about Jason? Nope. <laughs>